Oh, Cavalier. There you go. Wow, we discovered a Cavalier. Last episode. I forgot about that. Now we're doing this. Yamato? Wait, what? Wait, what? Where are we jumping to? In 12. Why we miss mission 9, 10? I mean, well, 10 was the... Suffering defeat after defeat. That man's body was reaching its limit. Breaking down. But he couldn't die yet. The man had a job that must be done. To defeat his twin brother. What? Why? Virgil, come on. Man. Dante. Oh, same voice actor, thank God. Thank God. Please tell me they actually look alike. Well, Virgil is... What? Heavy chain that does freeze my bones. In order to defeat his younger brother, he could only do one thing with the crumbling flesh and feelings. He needed to separate man from devil with the strength of the Yamato. What? And eventually, the man became a true devil. So V is Virgil. Oh God. Oh God, no. Oh, you're lying. Oh, I didn't see that. I didn't saw that twist coming. I've tried to hold together my crumbling flesh with what little demonic power I have left, but I'm approaching my limit. Oh no. In separating and regaining my human soul, I've realized the gravity of the crime I've committed. I've realized how important everything was. Everything I've thrown away in my pursuit of power. Virgil, is that really you? Is that why you went to find Dante? Yes. Foolish. I thought that maybe he could change my... Maybe fix. Maybe right my wrong. Tell me. That is Virgil, goddammit. Was this fool before you, right? I'm not your mommy, V. You're a big boy. Yes. And you need to see this through. Dante's war. Oh, yeah. Yeah. How's that for Road Rash? Hell yeah, buddy. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um. <laughs> That's awesome. Hilarious. Uh, where's the Cavalier? There you go. Alright, cross line. We got that thing, which is not bad at all. While on the ground, press Shift plus plus space plus. Okay. What is that? <laughs> and oh my god, all of the people. Hey, 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 everybody. My name is Strife. You know, welcome back. Devil May Cry. Yep, that's it. Devil May Cry 5, mission 11. Yamato. Question is like. Well, there's Unless no question. You right. die. Just give me a second. Just get the hell out of my way. Give it up! Don't Oh, 
Still fighting this one? Other thing? Yeah. Yeah. For a second, I actually thought I bugged the game and I. Oh, that's a prison. Okay. <laughs> hey! Rip it up! That's rebellion. You need some blood, huh? Sorry, you wouldn't like mine. No, no, I get it. I get how this works. Let me just, you know, look around, see what I have to loot. I don't have the ugly ass thing. Got the blood over here. Need to make it. Oh. Huh. Try blood in the gutter here. Guess that explains how the pools down there get filled. There you go. That's the ugly thing. Check it out anyways, right? Like I don't know if the game is gonna screw me over. That's good. I just 
crashed into that thing. Okay, that's crazy. Awesome. Purple orb. I think that's the fourth. So I suppose we can do something up there that will actually this thing, you know, destroy. Huh. So they came backward. Oh. Ooh. Okay. Now I remember something that I I'm not sure if the developers actually did here, but they will make try. Fury. Uh they actually did a very cool enemy. One that was probably one of the best. Well, This very fast assassin enemy that was pretty cool, and I'm thinking like these guys may actually make it here as well. May may have made it. Here. I'm not sure. We'll see, I suppose, right? All right, my path was from here. I came from the van. Go this way. Oh great! Crossroads. Decisions, decisions. This one of the places with blood. See it down there, the siphon. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, big guy. No, 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 no. Dante. Good job, my man. That's why you're my man, Broski. That's uh, that was the thing that actually painted. No, I don't know what it's called. Win in doubt. Smack. That's your family mark. <laughs> I'm telling you, a lot of the things Capcom used in Monster Hunter World, they're used here as well. When in doubt, smash it. You know, in Monster Hunter World, they say, when in doubt, take a bite. So it's weird, yeah, I know, I know. But I'm not the one making these things up, so. Was oh, okay, okay. oh, that it? All right. Yep. Here comes the blood.
when you cannot contain what's naturally a beast. I just love it. I love it. Stylish points. <laughs> Three, two, one, zero. What is that voice? That voice? <laughs> More blood pouring down. There you go. That's very high up. Don't want to keep Mr. Demon King waiting. Gotta pick up the pace. I mean, it's not necessary. I have some. Uh, actually, a lot of these. I don't know if I'm gonna be needing those. But let's collect them for now. went the right way. So, what now? Are we done with this thing? Ah, Let's see what happens. Who knows? Maybe it'll be fine. There's so many detail of everything that we're going through right now.
these grooves. And there we go. That's the final stream. Uh, we should go down to the path of blood, I suppose. Last question, how am I gonna get through? Ah, yeah, I, yeah, I thought that was something on the chest, actually. Alright. That should be all of them. Well, true, but still, I think, you know. It's been a while since I used my brain this much. Damn it! Yeah, there's a secret mission that I, I gotta go uh, somewhere over there in order to unlock it, but that's for music though. Oh, right now, Dante realizes that this thing, the Demon King, is his brother. But I don't know what V told him about this thing, and I'm <laughs> curious to find out what Dante knows and how he feels about Virgil. Because Virgil is. Come on, man, it's his brother. It doesn't matter how. <laughs> Bad the dude is. That's his fucking bro. We should love each other. And how did Virgil survive whatever that thing? Oh, okay. uh, I don't think I need anything right now. Huh? Huh? Holy shit! I can't believe any of this is still standing. That's his house. Oh god. Oh god, look at the land. It's so fucked up. Right. Come on, Anthony. Guys, look at this magnificence. Okay, that's not good. <laughs> well, that's the spire. Come on, buddy. Ha! Here you are. Hey, what's wrong with you? Hey! Hey, Dante! The demonic power was activated in me once when Virgil lovingly jammed this through my chest. <laughs> I always wondered. Why did my father give me the rebellion? Okay, what are you muttering? <laughs> Over the years, I've been stabbed and jabbed by a number of things. But who would have ever guessed? Have you lost your mind? There's a demon to destroy! Kill yourself later! I'll help! If the Yamato can separate man from devil, 
And what about the rebellion? Wow. You are absorbing the Sparta. What? So it was Dante. Okay. Oh wow, that is so cool. That's a, That's a demo form we can stand behind, guys. It can't be. Dante, you son of a bitch. I know you couldn't be killed that easily. <laughs> hey. He's all yours. But don't let it become a habit. Win, Dante! Win! Rebellion versus Yamato. Dante versus Virgil. Never saw Dante. No more Sparta, no more rebellion. Only Dante. We're talking about the devil's hero. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> Devil Sword Dante. A blade born when Dante absorbed the rebellion into his body. The weapon shares both his name and his will. Oh, that's so cool. Guys, can you feel the hype? The hype is real. Ow, hit my I'm sorry. Alright, I suppose it's time. It's time to kick some ass. Alright, the basic ability of Rebellion Devil Sword Sparta carry over to this blade. Pressing in Swordmaster style conjures swords that attack autom oh, what? autonomously. Alright, sorry. Autonomously. Use the blade. Blades in tandem. Oh, in, in tandem for a relentless wave of hack and slash charge. Uh, activating Devil Trigger with this equipped will conjure. <gasps> oh, now he has the Virgil thingies. Alright. Uh, conjure swords that provide different type of support depending on your style. These include higher mobility, similar effects, and health. Red Dante. You want to talk? You know what you want. Alright, so hold F to charge from the Devil Trigger Gouge to the Super Devil Trigger Gouge. <laughs> There's a new gouge above the Devil Trigger Gouge. Oh, Sin Devil, not Super. <laughs> Sin Devil Trigger. Sin Devil Trigger Gouge to fill this gouge. Oh, as for power from the Devil Trigger Gouge, bring down. Uh, hold. Uh. Nowhere to go.
This time, and you still don't get it. It's not bad, honestly. I, I love the rebellion. It is you who does not understand. Come on, boys. It has begun. For a second, I thought that you go now. That house is pissed off. And lady are gonna have a, you know, a romantic evening because these guys are going boots all in, deep in with her. Oh come on, Trish. Not that heavy. How the hell the human? Human Virgil got those demons with him. The Clan Fart is revealed in its entirety. <laughs> this inconvenience matters not. <laughs> This, this part right here uh, gives us so much questions. Like, what the hell is happening? Why? How did Virgil, uh, first off, how did Virgil survive whatever he survived, you know, after being killed as Nilo Angelo and destroyed or whatever? Uh, how is this gonna go on? And most importantly, what will become of Dante at the end of this game? Because we're reaching a very, very high threshold and point of the game and the story and stuff like that but anyways we, we will continue to see what's next and we're gonna end it there three warriors all right so dante <gasps> Nero, and i mean yeah. human virgil <sighs> oh that's bien well, looks like no one's worse for wear. I suppose we pulled so we got destroyed, so <laughs> that's the new closure. I'm just gonna double check. Hey, where did that garbage god go? What is yours in after? He's at the top of the Clyphod. 
It's the other way around, Dante. This is the lowest level of the Clyphod's upper echelon. Human blood is the source of demons' power. The fruit born through the Clyphod is even more dense than the blood that created it. Its power is unparalleled. Even the almighty Mundus used it to become king of the underworld. Avid told me everything. Yeah, well, that's a lovely story and all, but as long as we know where to find him. Come on, she doesn't look like Trish. Whoa, you are the infamous Dante. Um, <clears throat> I'm Nicoletta G Goldstein. Sound familiar? <laughs> um, my grandmother is, is Nell Goldstein. The, the gunsmith that made all your fancy weapons that you got strapped back there. <laughs> yeah, there she is! <clears throat> mm, you don't much look like her. Yeah, I got my looks from my daddy. That's about all I got from him. Come on, hug the boy. But man. based on his research, I, I managed to cobble this. Um, it, it, consider it a gift in honor of us finally meeting. Um, meeting. <laughs> I cannot believe they went there. <laughs> no, that's Dante we all love, man. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Whoa! Yeah! <laughs> yeah, I'm the same way right now. I'll take that. <laughs> Dante. I'm gonna go too. Oh, God. Why don't you sit this one out? Oh, that you call me dead weight again? No thanks. I've got all the power I need. Right here. You don't understand. It's not what I mean. <laughs> Let him go, Dante. Time is a luxury that we can no longer afford. We must chase after him post-haste. What? Does that mean you're going to? I have a duty to see this through. Well, that's all you had to say, Mr. Poetry. I'm gonna go my way, and you guys can go yours. Let's just say that's the best for the cause. I mean, all I can say right now is that I, I feel like Dante is protecting you. He's not trying to mess mess with him. He's not trying to do anything bad with him. He's just trying to protect him because he knows who he is. I think Dante knows that Nero is Virgil's son, but we'll get to that point later. Anyways, I'm going to cut this episode here. <laughs> this has been an amazing finale and everything. Like Dante <laughs> playing off as Michael Jackson. I love it, God. Uh, don't... Is it Dr. Faust? <laughs> it's amazing. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, I will see you all with the next one. Bye-bye.